downtown, walking fast, faces pass and I'm homebound. Hey guys, uh, let's take a picture. Okay. Hey, we look really good in this photo, but I think we should edit it. Okay, I'll teach you. Uh, first, we'll need an editing program. I think we'll use Photoshop. First, you'll need to go to adobe.com where we can make and create an account. Press sign in and another window will open. On this page you'll see that it says don't have an Adobe ID. Click there where you'll be sent here to create an account. And I'll just type in my information. Password. Password again. And I'll type my name. Uh, if you want to stay informed via email about Adobe products and services, you can check that and click create. Some time. Welcome, Akeem Kip. The following information is optional but may help us improve your experience. Um, here you can type in an ultimate email address, your job function, and your industry. Um, but I'm going to skip this step. And now I am in my account. Awesome! Uh, so from here, we're going to go. We're going to go to products, and we're going to go to Photoshop. Here you can see the selection of different um, Photoshop products that they have, but we're actually looking for Adobe Photoshop Express, which is right here. Here you will see the cool website of Photoshop.com. From here, we're going to go to My Home. And I'm going to log in. As you can see, it needs you to verify your account. To do so, you will need to go to your email that you registered your Adobe account with. Once verified, you should see this page. Congratulations, your account has been verified. Please sign in to start exploring Photoshop.com. Oh cool, now we have an account. In which we'll sign in again. Here, you see your home page. On the right hand side, we'll see a button with an arrow pointing up that says Upload Photos and Video. Click on that button. We will then click on Choose Files and select our picture. We would upload to a new album that we'll title Writing 307. In short, WRT. 307 and then click upload once our photo is uploaded we'll click on view album and then click on the right hand picture once we do that it will bring us to a page with a larger view of our group picture with some options below it for editing. Click on the third button from the left with the mini pencil. Clicking on this button brings us to Adobe Photoshop Express Editor that will give us options for basic editing, adjustments, and effects. So what do you think about this picture now? I mean, I think we look fine, but these kids totally ruined our picture. Do you think we could crop it? Sure thing. Well, hello, my fellow classmates. It's nice to see you again. Okay, to crop, under the basic tab, we will click crop and rotate. For crop dimensions, we'll then select the drop down menu for constraints and freeform the crop to our liking.
Once we've cropped, we have to make sure we don't select done as this will exit the editor. Oh my god, I look so pale in this picture. Do you think you can fix that? Yes, you can fix that with the white balance effect, which I'm going to show you guys right now. Nice. We can select white balance and Photoshop will show you eight different options for our photo. How about this one? So what do you guys think of the photo now? Um, I think it looks good, but can we fix the lightning? We sure can with the autocorrect feature, which I'm going to show you guys right now. We will click on autocorrect and pick one of the five options given to us. So what do you think of the photo now, Steven? It looks beautiful. Great, so let's save it now then. First, we'll add some text to the bottom right of our picture by selecting the Decorate tab in the top left and to the right of Edit. We will then click on the text button and type in WRT307. Finally, we will save this picture by clicking done when we are finished with all changes. It will ask us what we would like to do with this picture. Okay guys, what would you guys like to do with the picture? Let's put it on Facebook. Yeah! yeah. Facebook. Okay, we will click on the share button with the Facebook icon on it then. I must say this picture did come out pretty nice. Good job. Yeah, good, good job. job. <laughs>